Hey guys, Johnny here. I'm back with more Unkilled today. On my previous video, I asked you guys, what should I do with my gold? What do you do with your gold in Unkilled? And all you guys mostly said you should buy chests because that's the way to go with your gold. I'm a noob in Unkilled. I just started and I spent like $5 in the game just to get the special offer at the start. So I got 7,000 gold with the free gold and stuff. I can buy five golden chests three times probably and that's gonna be pretty much it. So from what I understand, I guess you get cards in these chests. Well, you can see the chances uh, if you click at the top. So you see the percentage, 50% chance at rare, uh, 27 epics, almost no chance at legendary. But what you get, I think, is weapon parts and then zombie parts for your, uh, your base defense or something. So I also think that a lot of stuff is locked until you progress in the campaign. I'm still at the start of single mission. I'm at tier two. So a lot of stuff is locked and I think it cannot drop yet. But still, I'm gonna go ahead and open the chest, see what's inside and leave me a comment below. Is it good or bad? Let's do this guys. All right, so first opening, I got two rares and one uncommon. And then again, it's a double drop. So I got two drops of the blue one on the left and two drops on the green one in the middle. And then linebacker, a rare zombie card times two. All right, second opening, two epics and one rare. That's opening number three, a bunch of linebackers again. This time I got intel so that I understand when you have a hundred something, uh, you can level up or something or get more skills. Uh, I got Carver now, new zombie I haven't got before, and that's five already. So I got a bunch of purples, a bunch of blues, and what I understand also is uh, when you spend gold, you get a free unkilled chest. So if I spend 10,000 gold total, I will get a free unkilled chest, so you can get skins and stuff. So let's keep going and buy five more. All right, I got more intel this time, 15 pieces and uh, MP5K. I got second chance three times, bunch of zombies, weapon pack this time, no idea what that is. Weapon pack again and some tomahawk, that's five again, we can do it one last time, let's do this. One purple, couple rares, three rares this time, couple uncommons. This time I got adrenaline times two, so yeah, you can get gadgets in here. More zombies, more weapon pack. Then you see my progress, I'm at 69.70 out of 10k for my free unkilled chest. So maybe in a future video, we're gonna open my first unkilled chest. So let's go for some action now. So that's what you see at the bottom. All the zombies that are locked, I have to find cards. And when you get like 30 or 20 of each, you can unlock the new zombies and level them up and use them later. Another cool thing I unlocked this week is called Supply Run. Uh, I talk about it on stream today, but it's six levels. And you only have one chance if you miss some stars you cannot try again so you do one run and then the total stars will give you your reward so you get 15 stars out of 18 max you will get the golden chest uh, and the supply but if you don't get 15 if you get 12 you get two supply and if you only get eight uh, you'll get supply chest but you need at least eight so i'll just do my supply run and then we'll see what i get all right, that's pretty much in the bag. I need one more star in my next mission. Kill 15 zombies with a melee weapon. That's pretty easy. Do nine multi kill. Should not be a problem. So let's go. All right, let's go with the knife. And uh, I did I did that a couple of times already. Never a problem. Just bash like that. You even get multi kills at the same time. Sometimes. Just. Uh, Leave my finger on the trigger. There's the one multi kill already, two multi kills, three multi kills, and already 11 kills with the knife. So, see, not not so hard. I'll just go with the 15 kills and then I'll switch to my primary weapon and I'll get the remaining multi kills. There you go, that's 15. So, for the multi kills, I just let them group up and that's another easy multi kill. But we got 40 seconds left, so still need the zombies. Alright, that should be another one, right? Five multi kills. It's gonna be six, I hope. Yeah. That's it. Seven. And hopefully that will be eight. Yeah, we need one more multi kill. 24 seconds. Boom. That is it, guys. So it's another easy three stars another easy 
Not always easy, but that one was pretty easy. The the melee mission, I never fell. Oof. This thing is pretty slow, by the way. It's powerful, but it's slow. So, three stars on my last mission. That's it for the supply run. So, I got 17 stars. I missed one. And let's open the chest. So, more cards for weapons. And then the gold chest. Money. Glock and Saiga. So that's it for the supply run, guys. So to end this video, let's go back to the single player campaign. I'll do more off stream or uh, off video, but this is mission 13. This is tier two and it's a Gatling gun mission, right? Uh, complete the mission for one star, do 15 multi kills and kill seven zombies with explosives. I mean, that's a lot of stuff to think about. The multi kills, they will come if you focus on killing uh, zombie packs. But explosive, uh, I missed last stream, remember, on mission 12. So yeah, let's go and play. Mission 13, let's get three stars. All right, let's do this. Badass. I need oh, explosive first, right? Bro, that's moving a lot. And I have to think about the... Oh yeah, explosion. I have to think about the multi-kills also, you know? And if I don't switch spots, I don't have more chances at explosions. Unless I use uh, gadgets, right? Yeah, some guys saw it in the comment, gadgets could work. Yeah, that's it, that's it. Oh, that was so easy. So I got the explosion kills easy. Now I think, I gotta think about the multi-kills and try to shoot at packs. Let's go for one more. That's gonna be multi kills, right? Nine multi kills. Do we moving? Okay, so we got more time. I need six more multi kills. Did he get crit in the back? Is that a multi kill, please? No? I got explosives. Explosive skills. Multi kill. And multi kill 11. I mean, how quick you gotta be for multi-kills? I mean, I don't know. That's 12, so need three more. But if it's the end of the mission, we could be short. 14? Oh, that's gonna be it, guys. That's gonna be it, right? I mean, yeah, there you go. 15 multi-kills and easy explosion kills. So just finish the mission now. I got the three stars. Bro, this thing is pretty cool. I should have reloaded there. I was at 16. Oh, this is OP. Uh, good time to reload, I guess. Oh, wrong button. I use adrenaline. Ouch. I gotta figure out my uh, my buttons, guys. It's gonna be expensive. What a bad, bad mistake. Is it the end of the mission? Oh, that's it. That's it. It's a success. I might do one more that was pretty quick so finish in a minute 10 and complete with uh, extra HP so let's try I guess why not right All right we gotta rush one minute max oh uh, there's a boss shit I miss this is not good I cannot miss two hits he's dead and there's the HP okay we got HP nice. now we just need to stay healthy and finish the mission quick i'm at 115 so i'm maybe just gonna blow the barrel so i won't take damage later but i got i gotta be careful still if i take one hit i need to either drop more health or heal myself with the the gadget i don't know the name sorry about that there's another one And another one. Cannot take a tap here. 
and more more health on the ground guys uh leave me a comment below if i leave it on the ground because i had like three if i leave it on the ground is it gonna disappear or i can leave it there and grab it later if i need it's like i totally know nothing about this game so you guys gotta let me know yeah what happened if you leave the perks or the drops and i grab later but still hey three stars again uh doing good so far but that's gonna be it for today's video guys i don't want to make uh 45 minute videos you know oh yeah and we got more gold so I'll, I'll stack my gold i guess so i'll end the stream with again asking for your help leave me some tips in the comments guys uh, what should i do next is it okay if i keep going for uh, maybe completing the campaign trying to get as many stars as possible or is there anything else i should look for right now as a new player well i'm definitely gonna keep playing that and uh yeah waiting for your comments guys thank you for watching hope you enjoyed the video leave a like if you did don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more shotgun legends and unkilled i will be back soon till then watch my other videos take care